Miss Becca here. Today we are going to start learning about flowers. I have a flower in my hair and I also have a few flowers right here. Can you look at those? I'm going to smell them. Mm, they smell so nice. These are yellow daisies and these are a type of flower. I'm going to put these over here so you can see them. And I want you to think about the word flower and what letter the word flower starts with. Hmm, I'm thinking about it. F flower. F it starts with a f sound. Which letter says f Hmm, think about it. F, right. So I'm going to write the letter F up here because I want to write the word flower on my board. So I'm going to start with a F. Big line down, two little lines across. There is an F. Now I'm going to write the rest of the letters in the word flower. You can watch while I do it. And I want you to try to see if you can name any more of these letters. That's the word flower. F L O W E R. The first letter in flower is F, and the last letter in flower is R. There are one, two, three, four, five, six letters in the word flower. So we made the word flower, but what I really am excited to do today is draw a picture of a flower. Because we know we can make words, but we can also make pictures to match our words. So what I want you to do right now, I want you to, you're going to pause this video and you and your mom or your dad are going to go get a one marker and one piece of paper. So you're going to go get one marker and one piece of paper and you're going to come back and join me. Okay, you can pause now. Okay, so this is the word flower and now we're going to make a picture. You're going to draw the picture with me. So get your marker ready. Get it ready. Don't put anything on your paper yet. Just get your marker ready. And let's start by thinking about what a flower looks like. What kind of lines or shapes are in a flower. So take a second right now, close your eyes because I don't know about you, but I think better when I close my eyes sometimes. I can imagine things. So close your eyes and think about the different lines and curves and shapes that you see in your flower. Hmm. Okay. Think about it. What does your flower look like? Does it have any curves in it? Does it have any lines in it? Maybe there are big curves, maybe there are big lines, maybe there are little curves, or maybe you have some little lines in your flower. And you know how to make all of these. So you'll be able to make a flower. Okay, so I'm going to go first, put your marker down and watch. I'm going to start with a circle. So now pick up your marker and I want you to draw one circle in your, on your paper. Okay. Next, I'm going to make curves on my flower. Put your marker down and just watch first how I make my curves. One curve, two, three, four, five curves on my flower. So now you can pick up your marker and draw curves around your circle. Hmm, what do you think comes next on your flower? I'm going to make a big line down. 
Now you make a big line down. Okay, put your marker down and watch. Next, I am going to make two more curves. One there and one there. Those are the leaves on my flower. So let's look at my flower. It has a circle. It has little curves. It has a big line down, that's called the stem. And it has two little curves. Those are the leaves of your flower. So you can finish your flower now. And I also wanna challenge you to try to write this word on your paper. Can you write these letters, F-L-O-W-E-R? on your paper too? Or maybe you can just make the letter F, okay? All right, now, once you're finished with this flower, I would love to see some more beautiful flowers because flowers are all very different and they don't all look like this. So maybe the flower you're imagining looks very different and I'd love for you to try to draw some other types of flowers and then send me a picture. Bye friends, have fun drawing.